Female retention. Females will think you're weird, bro. Like, people in general will look at you like you're weird. They're going to look at you like, yo, what's wrong with you? Like, why are you behaving like that? You know, like it's crazy, bro. But before we get into the video, man, make sure to smash the like button. You already know what to do, man. Let's get the video out there to more people. Make sure to hit the red subscribe button and join the family. The channel's all about self development and becoming the best version of you. Comment down below, let me know what you get from the video. And make sure to check out the description, man. My social media on there, the Discord group on there, Patreon, everything's going off in the, in the description. Now let's get straight into this video, man. Semen retention, females will think you're weird. Like, even men will think you're weird. Why are they gonna think you're weird? Because you're doing something that the majority of people don't even think about. Never mind even attempt. You have to understand, when you're on this semen retention journey, it's only for the select few, it's only for the chosen ones. You understand? So like, once you tell people about your journey of retaining your seed and not watching them demonic websites and that, they're gonna look at you like you're some weird guy. Like, yo, 99% of people are doing this and you decide to not do this, it's like you're an outcast straight away. Straight away, you're an outcast, you know? People are not gonna understand, like, why, bro? Like, you know what I'm saying to you? Like, like some, some guys are gonna think you're gay or something. I ain't gonna lie. Like, people are gonna think maybe this guy's gay. Like, you know what I'm saying? You may not be attracted to females. I don't know. Like, but what you have to understand on this journey is that uh people won't, won't understand you they just won't get it bro they just won't get it they, they cannot comprehend it it does not make any sense to them because they are programmed to behave a certain way they just know what is normal like people go off what majority of people do so whatever the majority are doing people feel like that's the right thing to do or that's okay to do you know but it doesn't make no sense because you're not thinking for yourself majority of people are drinking you you think drinking is okay because most people do it smoking people a lot of people smoke you know, so you think it's okay to do it because you're following the crowd and that. You feel what I'm saying to you? Now, the thing is you have to understand is that me personally, like I tell people my journey, bro. I ain't, got, I ain't got nothing to hide. I'm very confident and very definite into what I am doing and where I'm going. So I'm open about my journey. I tell people like, yo, I'm on semen retention, bro. Yo, I don't even watch them sites. Yo, I don't drink. I don't, I tell people that openly. Why? Because I don't fear what the next man's opinion is, you know what I'm saying, to of me, because it makes no difference to me at all. No matter who it is, friends, family, it doesn't matter. I can tell anyone what I'm doing and that, and I'm good with that because it's like, I know myself and I know my journey. I'm walking my own path. I'm not competing with anyone. I'm just simply walking my path. So when I tell people what I'm doing, initially people were quite shocked, like, oh, wow, really? Like, well, that's crazy, man. Yo, how do you do that? You know? But at first in my journey i wasn't open about it i felt like what's the point of me telling people no one's gonna understand and uh, people are gonna judge me and etc etc but it doesn't matter bro you know what i'm saying to you, you can judge me you cannot judge me you can whatever you think that's your that's just down to you bro that has nothing to do with me i know my path i know what i'm doing you feel me so like when you tell people like it's up to you if you want to tell people or not what what path you're on but I believe in living your life openly. Like, not you don't have to tell people everything that you're doing, but bro, I ain't got nothing to hide, bro. I'm walking the righteous path. So I'm not allowed, to, I feel like I need to tell people this, you know what I'm saying? If, if the question, or if the subject goes into that way, I'm not gonna start preaching out to people randomly. If someone asks me a question about what I think about this and that, I'm gonna tell them the truth, bro. What's the point of hiding from yourself and that, you know? So it's like, there's a level that, of confidence that comes with that, you know, you need to get to a certain level of confidence for you to speak openly about your journey and what you're doing and that, especially if most people are not doing it. Now, the thing is though, people are going to look at you like you're weird and that, but people are going to be more curious at the same time. They're going to look like, yo, like this guy's in a different vibe, bro. This guy's vibe is different. Most people just think about, yo, getting females, you know what I'm saying, to watching them sites and doing all that matrix stuff and that, but this guy's different. This guy's mindset is different. This guy's journey is different. His aura, his, the way he behaves and, you know, it's all different. So people are going to be more curious. People want to believe all that. People want to get closer to you. People want to know like, yo, they want to dive into your mind and that. They want to know like, yo, what is going on in this guy's head and that. I probably can learn something from him and, you know what I'm saying to you? So it's like, yeah, man, I feel like it's good to be open about your journey and what you're doing. Uh, one, you're going to inspire people, you know, to, well, it, for the person who's interested in that to follow follow suit uh also it's like it's a freedom that comes with telling the truth and telling 
just just expressing yourself you know like it's like you're you're, you're free and that when you have to hide it no i'm not telling no one what i'm doing and that like if so, no i'm not telling no one if not if i tell someone then they're gonna judge me it's like you're trapped in that like you, you're stuck in a bubble you feel me so like i feel like personally it's great to just express yourself and that because it's like you just feel free bro like you feel me so it's like don't like it's a lonely journey like i said before it's a very lonely journey like people are not you, people not you know what people not gonna understand you bro and it's like some people will not, not are not gonna want to be around you and it's like bro you have to be ready to, to to walk the lonely path man like solitude and walking your own path bro that's how you grow fast bro when i look at my journey of self-development i've been been on this journey for like over four years now yeah over four years yeah, way over, yeah, four and a half, four, four and a half years I've been on this journey, bro. I tell you now, like, by far, if you want to progress, if you want to level up on that, bro, you need to focus on yourself. Don't worry about your friends are doing, don't worry about your parents are doing, don't worry about anyone's doing. Focus on what you set out to do for yourself, and that's how you level up quick and that. You understand? People are not going to understand you. People are going to say you changed up and that. They're going to say, like, well, that's your opinion, bro. You know what I'm saying? To the whole point of life is evolution. I'm trying to evolve on that understanding that like so it's one of them things in that man people are going to look at you different they're going to look at you sideways and they're going to judge you they're going to talk about your back and that they're going to say all sorts of things about you and that you know but at the end of the day it's like know yourself bro know your journey know what you want to accomplish and walk your path and that this path is only for the selected few only for the selected few only for the chosen ones you understand that now. so you can't expect something like people to understand something that is not for them you know only you know why you're doing it only you know your path and that. no one can see your path bro only you can see where you're going you feel me so with that being said you have to understand that you just you just have to remain humble because you know i think that's another important thing on this journey of self-development in general like you can get to a stage where you become judgmental in a sense. Like I found I was I was in that stage as well. Like it's like it's like whoa. Like you realize that no one's on nothing, bro. Like people are literally just like like they're not progressing year after year in the same position, and they're just doing low frequency behavior and they're just like bots and that basically. You feel me, boss? Like you don't judge them and everyone's playing their position. Everyone's playing their position where they, what they are doing is what they're supposed to do. You understand? There's left, right. There's up, down. There's inside, outside. You know what I'm saying to you? Like, that's how it works. And so that person is playing the position that they're supposed to play. You feel me? So, female retention, people will think you're weird. Females will think you're weird. You tell a female right now, like, yo, hey, look, can't lie. Like, I'm not even trying to, you know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to boss and that. I'm, I'm, I'm holding my seat in and that. I'm, I'm practicing celibacy or female retention. So, look at you, like, like, yo, like, what's wrong with this guy and that? But at the same time, they're going to be curious, like, yo, I don't know, man. I need to see what this guy, you know what I'm saying? Like, but yeah, man, like stay, stay on your journey, man. And yeah, if the video, video brought you any value at all, if you got anything from the video at all, smash that like button so more people can see the video and get the blessings. Make sure to hit the red subscribe button, man, and join the family. I'm dropping videos like this on a day-to-day -day basis. Comment down below. Let me know what you got from the video. Let me know what you can add to the video or your own story. And yeah, definitely check the link in the description. My social media is on there. You know, got a Discord group. Patreon's about to get popping in that. Like everything's in the description. You know, DM me directly on Instagram for any more advice, video suggestions, anything. It's all in the description, man. Take care of yourself. Make sure you focus on yourself and make sure you level up, man. Come on, come on, come on.